What's up everybody, Chris Evans here, and you know, sometimes I get asked, Chris Evans, how do you get the picture in your videos so clean and so crisp? Well, if you were wondering the same thing, you clicked on the right video, and the answer is this. The Sony FDR AX33 Handycam, capable of doing 4K at 30 frames per second and 1080p at 60 frames per second. And spoiler alert, this thing is badass and I absolutely love it. So what we're gonna do throughout this video is I'm gonna show you what comes with this camera. I'm gonna show you some of the settings that are on the camera, what it's capable of doing. And of course, we're gonna test out the 1080p 60 frames per second and the 4K 30 frames per second. I'm gonna show you guys raw footage, then edited footage once the picture is all fixed up. As of right now, you've actually been watching me on the Sony FDR AX33. But without any further ado, let's get on to the unboxing. Alright, so here is everything laid out. This is everything that comes with the camera. I am not filming, obviously, with the 4K Sony camera. I'm actually filming with my Samsung Galaxy, the S20, or I don't know what they call these things now, but one of the brand newest Samsung phones out there on the market right now. So, again, it comes with one spare battery. Here you go, I'll hold it up to the camera right there so that you can see what size battery it needs just in case you wanna buy your own spare battery. Also comes with a thin micro to HDMI cable. You got all your instructions, comes in many different languages and you got this USB adapter. And of course, it comes with the camera itself. This is what it looks like on the outside. You got the nice microphone up top which is what I was using at the beginning of the video I didn't add a boom mic or anything on it so I wanted you guys to hear the audio quality straight from the camera's microphone itself you got a button for photos you're wide and tight obviously it's where the battery goes you got your power your um, start record button stop record this is where you would put the power cord in right about here and then on the side you got this little door right here latches open and of course you can plug in your microphones and headphones and all that and also that's where the micro USB cord plugs into right there you got your manual button and on the inside right there you got your night shot your power button all that good stuff it's where you put the memory card in where you put the micro USB to HDMI right there. There it is. There's your quick unboxing for the camera. That's everything it comes with. So next let's test out the camera and let's test out the 10K 60 frames per second and the 4K 30 frames per second. All right, so real quick before we get started, I just wanted to show you guys the UI interface on this thing. So cool thing is, is every time you open this up, the uh, lens protector opens up automatically and when you close it, it closes. That's pretty cool, I like that feature. Here is the screen, the UI interface right there. Now, the memory card you wanna get, especially if you're recording in 4K, is you wanna get this bad boy right here, SanDisk Extreme Pro. This is really good for reading and writing of 4K and you're gonna need a, a big memory card like that that can handle the 4K. You're gonna want the memory card to say V30. So if you see it on the side right there, that V30. That's what you want it to say on your memory card. That's gonna be the best memory card for this camera. Just go to your menu, all right, so there you go. You got your frame rate, 30 frames per second. I'm recording at 4K as it says right down there. So yeah, just kinda wanted to show you guys what the, what the UI interface mode kinda looks like. I'm not a big camera guy, so if you want an in-depth explanation of all of the UI and all the different functionalities of the camera, you're gonna have to find somebody else because that ain't me. On this channel, I'm just showing you what I got and how it looks, and then you can make your decision on whether you want it or not. All right, let's go test out now. Right. So in this video, we are looking at 1080p 60 frames per second, no touch-ups to the video using the camera's onboard microphone. Oh man! 
Now this video is also 1080p 60 frames per second, but with touch-ups in editing to like the saturation and lightness, darkness, all that stuff. victory over Ricky Flash, and of course with the heavyweight championship, he gets ran right into the top turnbuckle. Oh, the ropes right here, coming up off the ropes right now, gets a reversal, Ricky Flash. And a tilt the ball. Ropes right here, ducks under, and a big ass. Right there with a the follow-away slam, and a cabrón assault. And... And this is what the camera looks like at 1080p, 60 frames per second. If you were to take it to a, like a concert or an event in low lighting, there you go. That's what it'll look like. If you're a gamer like I am, this is raw footage before editing of us just uh, filming a Let's Play. Oh. And this is the final product with all the editing and touch-ups and color saturation, all that stuff. Mech guy. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, here we go. Now we're into the good stuff. 4K, 30 frames per second. This is all edited and touched up uh, with the color saturation and all that stuff. some outdoors action at 4k 30 frames per second at my wrestling school some of the students showing you what they got this is raw footage unedited 45 46 47 now here's that same footage that i used for a commercial that i made for my school this is all edited the saturation color all that stuff has been fixed and this is what it looks like professional wrestling the Cobra Clutch Pro Wrestling Academy is built on four key principles of wrestling. Footwork, time.
timing, commitment, and intensity. And here we go. For all my hot boys and gamer girls out there, this is raw footage of us filming a Let's Play at 4K, 30 frames per second, no touch-ups. All right, and here's that same footage with all the touch-ups, including uh, lighting, saturation, all that stuff, in an actual Let's Play video that I did. Yeah. And today we got our drinks, and for this special drunk play, we're doing an oldie, but a goodie. We're doing Wipeout for the Wii. All right, A is jump. Let's talk! No, no, I believe there is no duck. And here's a little bit of night vision action at 1080p, 60 frames per second for you. Some more night vision at 4K, 30 frames per second, no touch-ups. Well, everybody, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you found it useful. Let me know down in the comments. Are you going to buy the camera or are you not going to buy the camera? Let me know. Till next time, I'll see you guys on the next video.